thirtieth video of eight zero five one theories, and it's about the rotate and swap instruction. So now, for rotate instruction, there are some instruction like RL, RLC, RR, and RRC. So here in R RL. R stands for rotate and L for left. So what it will do is it will do the rotate operation. Mm, so simply just rotate the e register one bit position to the left. So if you have some data like one one zero zero. So after this operation, it will be something like a one zero zero one. So it will just rotate one bit position to the left of the specific register. Now in RLC, what it will do is it will just do the same operation like RL but with carry flag. So it will also rotate the carry flag one bit position to the left. So now in RR and RRC, RR means rotate the e register one bit position to the right. So now suppose you have some data like one zero one zero. So after this operation, it will be something like zero one zero one. And RRC means the same thing which we did in RLC. Just the right, rotate in right, rotate the e register and C flag one bit position to the right. So these are the these are some rotate instruction. Now the swap. What the swap will do is it will interchange the nibble of the register A. Means uh, suppose uh, you have some data in register A like. Uh, F is zero cross F F zero zero H. Some hexadecimal data. Uh, these are sixteen bit data. So you need some register which has sixteen bit long. So after this swap, it will swap the nibbles. Means after that, uh, the data will something like a zero cross zero zero F F. The data was F F zero zero. It will save the nibble. So after that, it will be something like zero zero F F. So it is just used to save the data if we need it. So these are the some rotate and swap instruction. Do like, share, subscribe, and comment below. And thanks for watching.